Hey there SharePoint enthusiasts! Welcome back to another super fun tutorial. Today we're diving into document sets in a modern SharePoint online UI. Are you ready? Let's get started. First things first. We need to activate the document set feature. Click on the gear icon in the upper right corner of your SharePoint site and select Site Information and the View All Site Settings. Under the Site Actions section, click on Site Collection Features. Find the Document Sets feature, and if it's not already activated, click on the Activate button. Now let's create a custom content type. I'll call it Client Document Set. Its parent will be Document Set Content Type. I'll add a few custom columns Year, Client Category, Client Name. Client Description. Now let's make the document set more efficient by adding default templates for the Word, PowerPoint and Excel files. This way, whenever you create a new document set, these templates will be automatically included. In the Client Document Set Content Type settings, find a setting called Default Content. Click on Add New Default Content. We'll upload the Word, PowerPoint and Excel files. Specify a few columns that will be shared across all documents within the same document set. You can also add a few columns to the welcome page of the document set. We'll add the new Client Document Set content type to a library. We'll navigate to the library and make sure Allow Management of Content Types is set to Yes. In the Content Types section, click on Add from Existing Site Content Types. In the drop-down, select Document Set Content Types, then Client Document Set. Now, when a new Client Document Set is created, you'll find your Word, PowerPoint and Excel templates already included. And if you're familiar with PNP PowerShell, you can also enable Modern UI for the new and added forms using the That Tofts script. And there you have it, friends, an easy-peasy guide to creating and managing document sets in SharePoint Online. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe for more exciting SharePoint tutorials. Until next time, happy SharePointing!